Raven Elise TV. Hey guys, what's up? It's Raven. Today I'm here with a really exciting makeup video. I'm going to be showing you guys a day to night makeup tutorial. So I'm going to show you guys a really easy daytime look and show you how to transform it into this nighttime look that I'm rocking right here. But the exciting part is that I'm going to be using my own palette. <laughs> So if you guys have been following me, you probably have heard me talking about Deck of Scarlet, which is a makeup subscription service where you get a new makeup palette every two months for $29.95. It's really cool because they work in collaboration with different beauty influencers. So every palette is curated by a beauty influencer. So not only is this cool because you get to support your favorite beauty influencers, but it also helps if you ever feel like you just get in a rut with your makeup and you're using the same old products and doing the same old looks with with this, you're going to be getting a totally new palette every two months to play around with and do different looks with. I have been signed up for quite a while, so these are all of my Deck of Scarlet palettes that I have gotten so far. So I can tell you guys that every single one is different. You're always getting something new. The quality of them is really, really nice. And these are full-size palettes, as you guys can see. This is not a sample product. This is not like a little mini palette. These are full-size palettes. But of course, I'm super excited for this month's palette because it's my palette. Deck of Scarlet reached out to me over a year ago. I think it's been almost a year and a half now. You guys know in the makeup world, it takes a long time to create these things. So I've been working with Deck of Scarlet for over a year. I was super excited when they reached out to me because I had been getting their palettes already. I had been using their products and I thought it was a cool concept. And now I get to be the artist in chief. But yeah, so this is what the box looks like when you get it in the mail. You open it up and it says you're in. And the first thing you're gonna see is this little card with some information on it. And it's so crazy to see myself on this card right now. So every palette that you get is going to have a card like this telling you a bit about the beauty influencer that this palette is inspired by. And then you lift this part up and you will see your beautiful palette and also there's an extra. So every palette comes with an extra product. So I guess I'll talk about this first. This is the Throwback Black Liquid Eyeliner. It's a marker eyeliner. It is a felt tip, a very, very pointy, very, very fine, perfect felt tip super black black eyeliner I personally love felt tip eyeliner marker eyeliners they're just really really easy to use and they give you that really good cat eye so I wanted to add in a black eyeliner and I named it throwback black because I used to wear a black cat eye eyeliner every single day as part of my everyday makeup back in college I stopped wearing it for a while but I was like we need to bring the cat eye back so I named it throwback black and I feel like like this is just something that any and everybody can use. Now let's talk about this palette. So it comes in its little sleeves. So I'm just gonna take that out. And the first thing that you're going to notice is that it's actually a two-sided palette. The main larger side is going to have the powder products and this little side is protected because it has lip products. What you're going to get with every single deck of Scarlet palette when you sign up for the subscription is three full-size eyeshadows and two full-size Size cheek colors as well as the two lip products on the other side. Working with Deck of Scarlet and being their artist in chief basically means that they created this palette inspired by me and of course I approved everything. I also got to name everything and just be a part of the whole entire process. The first shadow Vibes is a neutral cream kind of bone colored eyeshadow with just a little bit of shimmer in it and then this middle shade which is my personal favorite like star of the show shade out of this palette is called Zaya and obviously you can see why I named it Zaya and this is a shimmery metallic pinky bronze rose color and then over here the third eyeshadow is called bomb and that is a shimmery brown color it actually has a little bit of like a pinkish undertone I have it going through my crease right now then we have the two cheek colors the first thing I'm really excited about is the highlighter I named it literally get it, it's lit, like your cheek is lit. And this is a warm, golden, shimmery highlighter. It is popping. I feel like this is a type of highlighter that can actually look really good on all skin tones. And then we have the blush, which I named Bay. This is more of a deeper terracotta reddish tone. And if you use a light hand, it's good for lighter skin tones, but it's pigmented enough to actually be good for darker skin tones. For my lipsticks over here, we have Shambles up at the top, which is more of a 
brownish mauve kind of a neutral daytime lip and then the second lip color is called rant you can probably guess why I named it that if you watch my snapchat stories and this is like a brownish berry tone and it's more of a wow factor so like more of a nighttime lip or I mean you can wear it in the daytime whatever floats your boat girl so yeah you guys this is my palette it's really exciting I feel like it really is just such a raven palette I feel like it definitely represents me with all of the pink and the lip colors and the golden highlight I mean that's just so me like if you watch any of my makeup videos this is me if you sign up you'll be getting my palette and the eyeliner together like I said and also deck of scarlet is cruelty free and paraben free and if you are a new subscriber you can actually pick your first palette now so instead of just getting whatever palette is coming out the month that you subscribed you can actually go in and pick whichever palette you want out of the whole entire list not only that but they do also have a shop page on their website where you can shop any of the palettes in case you miss some you want to go back and and get one of the other palettes and there's also individual eyeshadows on there I have my own eyeshadow it's named Raven it's a metallic gold color that I really really love so definitely check that out as well shipping is available in the US Canada and the UK and like I said it is $29.95 really really affordable especially for the fact that you're getting a full face a full face a full size makeup and if you were to compare this to what you would be getting at Sephora it would be like over a hundred dollars for all this stuff and you guys know I always have the hookup for you guys so I do have a special link down below where you guys can get 35% off of your first palette so enough rambling I'm just really excited about this but if you guys want to see how to do a really easy daytime look with my palette and see how I transformed that daytime look into this nighttime look then just keep on watching okay guys so for this easy daytime look I'm starting off with my base already done so we can just jump straight into my palette for the eyes the first shade I'm gonna go in with is Zaya which is that metallic rose colored shade and I'm just going to end with a flat brush and packing that onto my lid this is a really really easy basically one eyeshadow eyeshadow look so I'm just applying this all over my lid and then going back with a fluffy brush with the same shade and kind of buffing it out throughout the crease just so that there's no harsh line I want this to look very easy and effortless and just look like a wash of color over my lid so I'm using the fluffy brush to buff everything out out. Next, taking the highlighter shade literally on a small brush, I'm just going to highlight the inner corners of my eyes. I love using highlighters for this purpose. It just helps you look more bright eyed and awake. Then going into my light eyeshadow shade called Vibes, I'm going to highlight my brow bone. This is good for a daytime look because it's still going to highlight your brow bone, but it's not going to add a bunch of shimmer. So it's a more toned down daytime look. This is just to help your eyebrows pop and to help your face look more lifted. Next, taking a small flat brush I'm going to be using that same shade vibes on my lower waterline this is also going to help my eyes look bigger and more awake taking the blush shade called Bay, I'm going to move on to finishing off the rest of my face by applying the blush to the apples of my cheeks I'm using a medium amount of product because I do have a medium skin tone but feel free to tailor it to your skin tone and now for my absolute favorite part of makeup which is highlighting my face I'm taking my highlighter called literally on one of my favorite highlighter brushes and I'm applying that to my cheeks and just look at that glow girl yes I love it it looks so pretty so I'm of course applying that to my cheekbones but I'm also going to sweep some across my forehead chin I'm also going to highlight my nose with a bit of a smaller brush just so I can get more precise with where I'm applying it of course applying it to the tip of my nose I like that to be very very bright and just highlighting the rest in my face like cupid's bow chin all that stuff finishing off my eyes for lashes i'm just gonna apply a nice coat of mascara i'm skipping out on falsies for now because i just want this to be a really easy simple fast daytime look like i keep saying and lastly for lips of course we're gonna go back into the palette and i'm gonna be using the lip color called shambles but first i'm going to line my lips i feel like anybody with any skin tone can pretty much wear any lipstick as long as you have the right lip liner to go with it so i've just put kind of a slightly darker lip liner and now I'm taking a little brush and applying the shambles lipstick I love the color of this lipstick and the fact that it 
is full coverage so you do get that really nice color payoff and it's got a soft matte formula and I just like the way it matches with the eyeshadow it's a nice monochromatic look and that is it for my easy daytime look so this is definitely a makeup look that you can wear to school or to work but let's say it's Friday and you're going out after work and you just want to zhuzh up your look a little bit well I have the answer for you I'm going to go in with the only eyeshadow that I did not use out of the palette the first time which is balm the brown color and I'm just going to use this darker color to deepen up my eyeshadow look so I'm taking a fluffy brush and I'm running this through my crease on top of the look that we already did and also taking another brush and deepening up the outer V of my eye adding this darker color to the crease and the outer V is definitely going to take this look to the next level so I'm just using the fluffy brush to make sure that everything is blended and then taking a clean brush I'm going back just to clean everything up and make sure that it looks neat going back into the shade Zaya I'm going to run that on my lower lash line and I'm just trying to make my lower lash line match what we got going on on top so I'm also going to be taking balm and adding that to the outer corner of the lower lash line as well now to really amp this up I'm actually going to wet my brush and go back into Zaya for a more pigmented more metallic color payoff and add that back onto my lid just to really really make it pop I'm actually dipping back into the highlighter shade called literally this is totally optional but I thought might as well amp up the brow bone highlight as well since we did use the more toned down shade originally and now it's time to use that throwback black felt tip marker eyeliner to create a dramatic cat eye winged liner I also went ahead and popped on some nice false lashes and this is one option for the finished look for the nighttime version because you can definitely leave this same lip color on it looks really nice with the eyes you can definitely wear this for a nighttime look but if you did want to amp up the lip color as well I am going to go ahead and show you guys what that would look like so going back into the palette I'm going to be using the other lipstick which is called rant but first just applying a matching lip liner just to make it a little easier on my Myself to color inside of the lines and then taking a brush and applying the lipstick I actually realized that with a bold color like this it's actually easier to apply it with a brush and that is it for the finished nighttime look so I hope you guys enjoyed this day to night tutorial I really hope you guys love my palette if you get it of course all the information will be in the down bar give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys in my next one bye